Welcome to Kramer Control Tutorials. My name is Brian Morris with Kramer Electronics. This video tutorial is going to discuss button states using button images. In K-Touch, you have the ability to create a pressed state and a selected state. When you create a pressed state, the button will appear animated when you press and hold it. When you let go of the button, you can use a selected state to show that the button has been selected. Using that, you can also have the ability to create a group with buttons, so you can have buttons select and deselect each other as you press them. Let's show some examples. By right-clicking on a button and going to Edit Button, you can get to the properties of that button. You can see here that there are three button image states, Default, Pressed, and Selected. By finding a button, and adding pressed and selected, we can have these extra functions. Simply drag the button image over to pressed, and selected. You also have the ability to create a group tag which will group buttons together. Using this group tag, you can have a group of source buttons that can select and deselect each other when they're pressed. Let's call this tag sources. Repeat those same steps for the other source buttons you'd like to use. If you have buttons that don't appear selected, such as volume up, volume down, and power, you can do the same thing, but skip the selected state. Simply drag the image to the appropriate state, let go, and click close. Let's repeat that for all of our other buttons. When you're done, simply save your configuration, back it up, and sync with your device. Now that we've saved our work in the builder, let's go to our app and sync our handset.
Once we've completed, let's navigate to the appropriate panel and check our work. As you can see, when I press and hold on my power button, it'll show as pressed. When I let go, it will execute the functions that are assigned to it. Same thing goes for source buttons. When I press and hold, they show as pressed. When I let go, they now show as selected. Volume buttons, when I press them, they show as pressed. When I let go, they go back to normal. The buttons in my drawer act the same way. My power button is the same way. That concludes this video tutorial. Please be sure to check out all of our other video tutorials. From Kramer Electronics, I'm Brian Morris.